everyone, my name is Grace, and today I'm going to read the Bible story. Today's the Bible title is Coming Home, a Father and His Two Sons. Let's read. Why does Jesus spend time with people who do, who do bad things? The religious leader wondered. So Jesus told them a story about God's love. This is how it went. So Jesus like was spending time. Jesus spent time with people who did like bad things and poor people. And the religious leader didn't understand. So Jesus called a story. Not fun the Bible jam. Washing pole. A man had a two son. The younger son asked for the money he would get. When father dead, heartbroken, the father gave his younger son half of his property. So, like, one man had two sons, and they, the old son was very faithful and done what he should do. And like younger and younger son was like asking the money he would get when father died. Did the religious leader understand what Jesus spent with people who do bad things? No. The religious leader didn't understand. The son moved to a distant country. He wasted all the money. Then a famine came and he had to feed pigs. He wished he could Eat, eat the pig's food. So the sun has moved like far away, and he wasted all the money what he had. And like, and he was so hungry that he wanted to eat pig's food. Father's servant do better than this. He thought I will return home and admit that I have sinned against him and God. Maybe he will make me one of his servants. So like he will, like he thought that his father's servant do better than this. So like he thought. If I go and and admit that I have sinned against Father and God, like he thought maybe he could like make me one of his servants. So he decided to go back home. We have found the Bible then. David falls from King Saul. The son went home while he was still far away from his father. Father ran to him and hugged him. I am not worse to be your son, he told his father. 
so the son has went home, <clears throat> and the father saw the son far away from home, and like he ran to him and like hugged him, like, and he was saying like, "I am not worse to be your son." The younger son admitted that he had sent by loving his father and wasting his money. True. Bring my son my best robe. The father told his servant, "Put on, put the ring on his finger." Rose, our. Fastest calf, and my boy was lost, and now he's found. So like, the boy thought he, um, <laughs> the father will make him one of his servants, but like now he's not. Like his father was like. Running to him and like hug him, and he said, "Bring my best." Like father gave him the best thing. Oops. Older son was angry when he had heard about the celebration. It's not fair, he complained. I worked faithfully and get nothing, and he wastes your money and gets a party. So, like, the older son was angry because, like, the younger son wasted his money and like came back and and. The, Older son was like faithful to his work and get nothing. But like, the younger son gets a party. All that's mine is yours, the father replied. Your brother was dead. Now he's alive. He was lost, and now he's found. So what can we do? But celebrate. <laughs> so like, God is saying, <laughs> his father was saying, like, your son, I mean, not, your brother was dead, and now he's alive. In Jesus' story, which person loved his younger son so much that he celebrated his return? Number one, the older son. Number two, the youngest son, father. Number three, religious leader. <laughs> Number two was the correct answer. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Does it enjoy? Then next time I'll read another good story. Then let's see you next time. Bye.